And then that is a W for Mr. Williamo, for Will. Or you could say it looks a little bit like a, a, a butt. Hello everybody, my name is Mr. Williamo and welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. And today, this video is a little mod showcase and... Ooh, that sounded like the doorbell. Is anybody there? Whoa, no one was there. That must mean... Well, there's a villager there, but that must mean that it's spooky time. It is almost Halloween time in two weeks or so, I think it's Halloween. So, sooner or later, those of you who like Halloween are probably going to want to be able to carve some pumpkins. So, that is what this mod does. It's called the Pumpkin Carving Mod, and it allows you to use normal pumpkins that you can find and grow in Minecraft. Just as you can see these guys here, this is how you grow them. I'm not, like, the best pumpkin grower, as you can see, because there needs to be some more space on this side of the house for the pumpkins to grow. But I've got one here, so that, that is good enough. This is, uh, this is Doctor Strange's house from the video where I grew a villager's nose, which is a very strange one. So if you've not seen that one, please make sure you check it out. It'll be on my channel. And I don't know where Doctor Strange is, though. That's not Doctor Strange, because Doctor Strange has got a purple outfit on, but whatever. So, this mod, it allows you to get pumpkins and carve them. Now, as you can see in the bottom right, it looks like the pumpkin is actually round a circle so it changes the icon for the pumpkin whereas usually in minecraft it's like a cube and when you hold it it's a cube anyway but if we go and like break this one here so oh i'm in creative mode i'm an idiot i forgot but if we broke it then it would just pop into our vent inventory and look like this one here what we want to do next is we want to carve we want to be able to carve the pumpkin okay there's dr strange dr strange do you want to be able to carve a pumpkin right i'll, I'll put one here for you that's the doorbell again what is going on? The doors are closed this time. This must be spooky. It must be so spooky. I don't know what's going on. But when we've done our pumpkin carving, we can light them up and then we can let the sun go down and then maybe some trick or treaters will come. So, Doctor Strange, you have to uh, do a carving in there, okay? And I'll do a carving in here and we can see what happens. Maybe we can scare some people. Maybe we can scare that guy right there, right? Sun's going down, which means we have to do our carving right about now. So, to carve the pumpkins, you're going to need yourself some shears, I know. I don't think I'd actually carve a real pumpkin with shears, I'd use a knife, but shears in Minecraft, it kind of makes sense. As soon as you look over a pumpkin using the shears, it automatically zooms in, which is pretty cool. So as he zoomed out, and what past, zo dude, he's supposed to be doing his pumpkin cut, he just got off. Maybe he's finished already, okay. I gotta get a, I gotta get a wiggle on, so, it zooms you in, and then all you have to do is put your cursor over where you want to do your pumpkin carving, you can hold it down, you can just right click once, and it's kind of like a little pixel art in a way that it looks really cool. And you just hold it down, and this is where you're carving out your pumpkin. We're just going to make a traditional pumpkin right now, and we can have, make him, we have weird, massive eyes. We'll have, we'll have massive eyes, okay? Alright, we've got to try and copy the one that I've done on this side. Um, I, th I think I might have done it wrong. <laughs> right, there we go. It's something like this, all right? Pumpkins are never perfect. If you ever do a pumpkin in real life, you realize that they're, they're never perfect. So, this one. Boom, right? Yeah, it looks a little bit different, but don't judge me. Don't don't judge a pumpkin either. He's just got two different shaped eyes. That's all. <laughs> That's all. So we can make him a mouth as well. I'm going to make him one of these creepy jaggedy mouths. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Ready for Halloween, baby. Oh, his mouth just kind of like joined up with his eyes there. Oh well. Yeah, that, that, kind, that kind of works, right? That is a, a creepy ass mouth. I made a bit of a better one before and I was just trying it out. As you can see, when I finish this guy... Right, that'll, that'll, that'll do, right? Sweet. That's beautiful. I, this, this guy. This guy's a little bit derpier, but it, it looks kind of more like a pumpkin. And then that is a W for Mr. Williamo, for Will. Or, you could say it looks a little bit like a, a, a butt. It looks a bit like a butt cheek. Don't you think so? Don't you think so? Right, we're going to see what Doctor Strange has done on his pumpkin. Something strange, probably, because it's in his name. All right, let's take a look at what he's done. <laughs> he's done a portrait of this guy here. Look at him. Well, he's got, like, hair there, whereas there, 
He hasn't really got hair. Maybe he asked him, he was like, you know what, you know I've not got hair, but can you do a drawing of me with hair? That would be kind of cool, like sometimes, I think it was Henry VIII or something? Or, I don't know, so, some really old person <laughs> that had uh, paintings done of themselves. They asked the painter to do one that looks completely different, and then if one looked like themselves, they'd kill them. Which is kind of creepy and kind of strange. That is like a bit of horrible histories, but with the pumpkin carver, when you go up to a pumpkin that's been carved and right click it with a torch, it lights up and it looks even creepier, so it turns into a kind of jack-o'-lantern. And now this area is nice and light. That, that kind of looks really cool actually, that one. Oh, whoops, I didn't mean to do that. And then if you want to get rid of the light and turn it back into a normal one, it disappeared. I left clicked instead of right clicking. Oh no. Right, so you just right click instead of left clicking. So we lost that guy. Well, I somehow lost some of the pumpkins. I don't know what's going on there, but it looks like you can't actually break them and they don't save, which kind of sucks. So if the mod creator's watching, either I'm doing something wrong or you can't actually save them. But yeah, it's beautiful. I think my creation of a pumpkin is a lot better than this creation of pumpkin. That just kind of looks weird. So we'll, we'll get rid of that. Look, it just kind of disappear. I don't know if you have to do them with shears or not, but they can't, they seem to disappear anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. So we can put this on here. And then people know that we're getting ready for trick-or-treaters. So trick-or-treaters come, and they'll be like, trick-or-treat! And then we have to give them sweets and stuff, okay? What What do you mean you've not got any sweets to give the trick-or-treaters? What are we going to give them then? Are we just going to have to make them do tricks, aren't we? Because we've not got any sweets. We could give them nether warts, or pumpkins, but they want sweets and candy, not, not a trick. Nobody wants a trick on Halloween. But <laughs> there we go. That is the pumpkin carving mod. It is a really cool mod, actually. It's something that definitely is a tiny little aesthetic change in Minecraft that I've never seen actually done before. So it is a pretty cool idea, and I really like it. So, if you have enjoyed this video, make sure you smash that like button down below. And if this is, by some reason, the first video you've seen, why not consider subscribing? It would mean a lot to me. But my name is Mr. Williamo. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all on my next video. Adios.